are placing our paper towel right on top of our store-bought cake. And now I'm gonna come in with some food colorings. We're gonna do every color here really fast. Just decorate our cake, make that plainness you saw on top look way better. So you just drop your color all around. Look how easy. What? Yep, this is the easiest and the fastest way to decorate a cake. And whenever you find those cheap cakes at the bakery that are just plain on top, they didn't do anything to it, this is such a great way to decorate yourself, okay? This is gonna look incredible, just wait and see. Um, now I'm gonna go with my red. Ooh. So what you see happening on top of here is kind of happening onto the cake as well, but it's gonna look much cooler. This is just, this is just the beginning. We're already almost there too. I'm so cute, confused about the paper towel. Yep, this is going to help it create a really amazing design. I guarantee you've never seen this before. This is such a great trick to decorate your cake. Now let's do a green. And the fun part about these colors is that you could go right on top. And that's also going to do something really incredible. Ooh. Underneath that paper towel. All of the magic is happening under the paper towel. Okay. So exciting. Yeah. So I really want to cover it up. So I'm just going to go into all these blank spaces because this store-bought cake was just so boring. I mean, I have a birthday party to go to and bring a cake for. I can't bring them this cake that was just plain. So let's add our yellow now. Already almost done. This is my final color. Oh, ooh. So exciting. This one really makes the magic. Look at that. So beautiful. Oh, the kids are going to be so ecstatic over this cake because they've never seen one like this before. No dinosaurs or Superman happening on top of this one. No boys. And it's a boy's birthday party, but this would work. For a girl's party as well. Yeah, you could do like pink and purple. Yep, you could do the girly colors, but I'm gonna go with the basics. I didn't have to do any mixing. The food coloring already comes like this. Um, I'm just gonna add a little more green because I really wanna fill in those spaces. Again, you could go right on top. <gasps> just like that. Look at that. Okay. I think I'm gonna fill in. I can see like where the frosting is. I just wanna fill in that edge. Let's go with a little bit of red right here. Ooh, this is going to look so amazing. I'm so excited to show you guys. Perfect. All right. Okay. I think we are good. Just fill that in. Doop, doop. Perfect. Ooh. Okay, so we're done with creating our design, but what's really going to make the magic happen underneath is we need to spray it. So I have a spray bottle here. And I'm gonna take some lemonade. You could do any liquid, water works just fine, but I love to keep a little sweet flavor. So I'm gonna use some lemonade, pour that into my spray bottle. Don't need too much, so I'll save this for the drinks they're gonna have with our pizza. Okay, now we're gonna spray this cake. And this is what's going to create that incredible design. Make sure it's ready. Ooh, there we go. Okay, you ready for this? Yes. All right, here we go. Oh Look at my this. gosh. <gasps> oh yeah. There it goes. Oh yeah, just really spray into it. Get it nice and wet. Everything is better wet. Oh, it's like a tie-dye effect. Exactly. You are not gonna find this at any bakery. This is a DIY. And look at this. You all have food coloring in your cabinets already, I guarantee. Look at that. Oh. Whoa. All right. I think this is ready. So I'm just gonna really get it in there. Okay. How should I reveal? I could just rip it. It's a paper towel. Ooh. All right. Are you ready? I'm so ready. Ah, okay. I actually need to spray this part right here. Oh, yeah. Okay. 
Here we go. Three, two, one. <gasps> oh. Wow. That is so cool. Oh my. Look at that. It looks incredible. That is the coolest boy's birthday cake ever. Add a candle on top. It's going to be great.